Hey, what would you do if you had the option to do nothing? Would you do something? That's the question that I'm begging today since I had a dream last night that I created a show by that title in which the main plot point was that I dressed up a baby to look like Hitler to test the theory that everyone says they will or would kill baby Hitler if they had the opportunity. But if you had the opportunity, would you? That's the question. Well, that's, that's a question. It's not the question. Clearly, I have uh, nothing to do today, seeing as how I'm wearing the worst outfit I've ever seen. And I'm sitting back in a chair. I'm casual. I'm open. Maybe in a different world, on a different day, I would be accepting of that, of the not having anything to do disease. But I've realized after my 1.30 wake up call that it's my grandma's birthday. And though I cannot be there to celebrate with her, I feel like I am obligated to make today count. I have a couple of ideas. My first was to go for a run, but what temperature is it? I thought she was gonna say it, it's 30 degrees. My second idea was to schedule an accidental run-in with someone, but I feel like that takes away the attention from my grandma. Um, the definition of an accidental run-in is when you show up somewhere you know someone is going to be, and then you pretend that you didn't know they would be there. I think that everyone probably does this and that it's normal. My third idea, well, I haven't thought of it yet. I think I'm going to take you through my routine of getting all dressed up for my big day out on the town. Uh, I don't feel like seeing anyone today. So if I do see someone, I'm hoping my disguise will prevent them from recognizing me. All right. Well, on that note, let's get started. I need to choose an outfit, but it needs to be an outfit that would not be immediately recognizable because as I said, I don't... Pick of the day, pick of the choosing outfit. I haven't made a video in a while, so I kind of forget how I'm supposed to act. Here's some jeans. Oh, diggity, hold on, wait a second. Now, have I got a shirt for you guys? I think I'll wear this. I'm going to do a little outfit transition. And there you have it. My hair recently has become extremely iconic. So I'm going to have to do something to combat that. I have this Carhartt hat. But also, slightly unfortunate, I wear the hat a lot. It's a very nice hat. So everyone will recognize the Carhartt logo from it, unless I fold it up, which I have just done. Now, I look horrible. Um, this has turned into a video where I have to learn to accept myself for who I am, because I don't like this situation. I will be right back. <sighs> On the way up here, I tripped up the stairs and it hurt really bad. Montage time. I think this is the one. So I'm ready for my night. I'm ready for my day afternoon on the town. First order of business. I don't know what to do. I'm gonna go for a walk. Actually, I'm gonna go get coffee. I have just realized that this is the footwear <laughs> that I have on right now and I definitely need to change. I, the glasses might be a little bit too much. I definitely feel very stupid. Into the palace. A lot of trash. Lots of trash. A couple of sandwiches. Happy birthday, Grandma. Something that's been on my bucket list 
um, in 2021 is to maybe once a week or so go somewhere that I've never ever been before, somewhere new and exciting. And I have just found the parking lot of of an Edward Jones next to a coin shop. And I've never been here before. I feel truly, honestly, functionally embarrassed right now. I am extremely in public. Oh my God, I feel like I'm in New York City. In my quest for self-fulfillment, I have been looking for a tarot reader. It claimed that there was one on this street, but I just went to where it claimed there was the tarot reader and it was an alleyway. So, um, I'm in a used bookstore. I know it's not a library, but I still feel obligated to whisper. This is my third copy of this book. I don't really have a conclusion for this video. I kind of just walked around and did random stuff all day and it was fun and it was nice. So there it is. That is the video. Thank you for watching or not watching. Thank you for resisting. Thank you for subscribing. And thank you for coming along on this journey with me, even though I didn't actually bring my camera for most of the stuff I did. So thank you for, um, Anyways, bye.